this is Kane Miss Natural Life. Thank you so much for joining me on my channel today. And I got my hair! Boom, boom! She cut it, she cut it, she cut it. <laughs> yes, I cut my hair and I love it. Yes! Well, actually, the husband cut my hair. It was kind of a like decision that I made that I didn't like act on for a while. I have been thinking about cutting my hair for a long time and I was just like, I'm so tired of all the detangling and all the stuff and I saw everybody with the cute taper cuts and everybody with all the just amazing hair styles and the color and all that stuff and I was really tempted to do that but I was just like, let me just take it one step at a time and plus the husband really likes my hair long um, and so I was like, let's compromise though, okay? You know, cause yes, I am the type of wife that I really do care about what my husband thinks about my hair. And it's the same with him, you know, he cares about what I think about his hair. And there's been times that he's wanted to cut his locks that he didn't because I like his locks. So, you know, there's some give and take in relationships and you know, some people agree with that, some people don't, but works for me. I've been happily married for 12 years and I'm just saying, you know, I wanna look cute for him. I wanna look cute for me, but I wanna look cute for him too. So, we did a happy compromise and I just said, well, let's just cut it. Like, I need to get some of that off. I'm sick and tired of wearing the ponytail. Like, y'all, I'm just tired, you know? I'm tired of wearing a ponytail. I'm tired of the buns. I just wanted to try something else you know do something else and so I was like well let's just go ahead and chop it you know and you know he didn't want me to go all the way back to the big chop nothing against the big chopping or anything like that but he was just like I really like your hair so you know let's work together so we did and actually I didn't go to a salon and he just basically I didn't blow my hair out or anything like that and he just basically cut it for me in the back and then we kind of stacked it a little bit so this is a homemade haircut but I like it so I'm excited about it it feels so much better it's not so heavy and it's hot in North Carolina right now y'all I mean yesterday the heat index was 104 okay it's hot ain't nobody got time for hair okay? you know thankfully bless the Lord for real you know my hair grows so it hasn't been an issue I cut my hair last year to my shoulders and it grew all the way back down to my armpits he did do a quick snapshot we had already started cutting but um, before we finished I was like oh my gosh we need to do a you know a length check or whatever so he pulled it down I was right above bra strap length bra strap length so that was pretty exciting um, and so I was really proud of my hair growth but I wasn't enjoying my hair so it's like let's just do something else it's a little while probably you know play around with a few different styles right now I just put a little pompadour up because it's hot too hot for the bangs okay um but I just put a little pompadour up I do want to try a for real wash and go like for real you know not the kind of fake wash and goes that I do um and everything where I just kind of lightly missed it you know wet it enough to kind of get a curl pattern and get curls um I did do a twist out this was using the Shea Moisture Lock and Twist Butter, which I will have a review coming up on that. And then I put a little bit of the Obia Curling Custard on top because it always makes my curls pop. So I mix those two, well, put, you know, the first layer on and then the second layer. And so I got nice curls mostly all over. I really want to try some more curly styles where I'm actually wearing it, you know, with my curls. So I'll do a video. And we'll see how it goes, because when I tried it before, it was like, mm, no, no ma'am. Um, but, you know, I'll try it and see and everything. So part of this natural journey for me is enjoying enjoying it. And if I'm feeling like mundane and just like, ugh, bogged down every time I have to deal with my hair, no. Okay, so I don't know. I'm just excited like this. I think it's good. It kind of makes me feel like in my earlier days, when I first started doing my hair, I was singing in the shower. I was just enjoying it. So... I don't know what y'all think. I hope y'all like it <laughs> as much as I do. If you don't, I'ma still love you though, but don't be mean to me in the comment section, okay? Cause it's not that drastic of a change. I mean, really and truly, it looks like how my hair, how long my hair was when I wore it in the ponytail. So when I would have my hair all up in the ponytail, the ponytail would reach down to here. So all I did was just cut it so that all of it reaches down to here. So I don't know what y'all think. I hope y'all like it. So <laughs> Maybe I am feeling myself just a little bit, you know? <laughs> a little bit 
But thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to check me out online everywhere at Miss Natural Life. Also check out MissNaturalLife.com. Don't forget to what? Subscribe because you love me. And you guys, all of you guys that actually put I love me in the comment section, thank y'all so much. Because I do. I love y'all. And I'm so thankful that you guys love me. Okay? And I've seen a little surge in my subscriber count. So hello to all my new subscribers. Welcome to my crazy. And thank you guys so, so much for watching. I love you all. For real. For real. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!